Uh, the controversial British-born author and journalist Christopher Hitchens has died. He was 62. He passed away at a hospital in Houston, in Texas, after a long battle, a very public battle, against cancer. Now, Christopher Hitchens began his career in Britain as a left-wing journalist. He then moved on to New York and, to a certain extent, to the political right. Christopher Hitchens was a provocative figure, describing himself as an essayist and contrarian. An author of 17 books, he was an atheist and an alcoholic, debating here with Tony Blair on the subject of religion. If I find that I'm alive in any way... At all. Diagnosed with cancer last year, he spoke to Newsnight about his declining health. I'm afraid of a sordid death. I'm afraid that, that I would die in an ugly or squalid way. And cancer can be very pitiless in that. I feel a sense of waste about it um, because I'm not ready. Um, um, I feel a sense of betrayal to my family. He began his career in Britain, moving to New York in the 1980s. His death was announced by Vanity Fair, where he worked as a contributing editor. The magazine said, there will never be another like Christopher, a man of ferocious intellect, who was as vibrant on the page as he was at the bar. Those who read him felt they knew him, and those who knew him were profoundly fortunate souls. Very rapidly expanded. Also paying tribute to him, a fellow author said that Christopher Hitchens could throw words up into the sky, and they fell down in a marvellous pattern. Helen Fawkes, BBC News.